What we're trying to do here today is install 655 metres of primus liner, which is going to be coming down through the park and going through an intermediate pit, and then that'll be heading up to the finishing pit at the top of the hill. This is a really innovative project. There's only been a few other installations in the country, and uh, this will be the largest installation of its kind in Australia. The length of this project is really special because it's 1,800 metres. Primus Line is a worldwide unique relining solution for the rehabilitation of pressure mains. The host pipe itself is actually in pretty good condition and therefore can take the uh, external load, as in of the soil on top of the pipe, for another 50 years without a problem. So this hose inside is a, is a Kevlar hose with an inside liner of PE. It basically can be folded up and put on a reel and helps us pull it all through the inside of the host pipe. It's a pretty new technology, but it's very, very strong, uh, and there's no worry about it actually taking the internal pressure of the water main. It's our third week. We should hopefully have the pipe commissioned by the end of next week. Excavating this job would probably take up to six months. The work site is discreet, it's out of the way. We're not disrupting anybody's traffic. Half the people in the street don't even know that anything's happening in there. I speak for me and my boys, we're really proud to actually succeed in this adventure. So it's pretty exciting for us, but the team in particular, we have so much confidence in what they're doing that we really trust the product they'll produce and that they'll do it to the highest uh, possible standard as well. It's a very big project, but I love the fact our team's doing it and um, that we're working so collaboratively with uh, such an innovative company. It's fantastic that the QEU team really picked up everything very quick and they're really enthusiastic and they want to learn and they really seem to like new technology. The advances in technology that keep coming and keep coming and the range of, of tools we have in the trenchless and toolbox is getting better and better and such that we're going to be able to do more and more work in a trenchless manner.